Okay, it looks like I found some friends for the way. So I'll put my bag. You can say hello to the camera. You are going to see me border. Okay, so we are going to the same way. Huh? Like you, you will have to tell me where is that because I don't know where is it. Okay, let's go. <laughs> Collected my gum. Thank you, Ogami. You're welcome, man. <laughs> you, man. Let's go to Benin. Let's have some fun, man. Let's hit the road. I hope it's gonna be okay. Let's cross this one first. <laughs> Just this uh, road from here to Badagri is. Uh, yeah, but it's all fine. Just follow the express. Yeah, yeah, it's fine, but it's not the most enjoyable. Right. So I'm making it interactive. I want them to also be part of it. The school is 10 years. Yeah. Okay, you can up. Just move it forward. Up, up, up. Good morning, sir. Good morning, sir. Okay, sir. Okay. I didn't mind. I When I reach with that, I call you. Okay. Take care, sir. Nice. <laughs> I will be very slow. <laughs> This stretch is uh, one of the last stretch on the road, which is not completely finished, if I'm not mistaken. Ah. So, welcome to the expressway. I don't know if I take the best way or not. You never know here. These roads are not perfect but with a good weather when you are not on a rush it's very interesting I hope you like it
with the truck yeah yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. I saw your bike ask camera yeah yeah I'm shooting my when I'm driving I'm shooting everywhere yeah thank you boss I, I like your country a lot you know there are many things you can say about Nigeria yeah yeah yeah, yeah. there are many things you can do around but there is one thing for sure is Nigerian people are very welcoming and they are very nice people so as you see as you can see me now we talk and it's fine no wala uh, thank you boss. So you're making a break now? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Or uh, repairing something? No, no, no. One of the two boys, I want to feed boys. Ah, yeah, yeah, I'm shooting you. He's working with this one also, right? No, it's two different camps. Okay, two different camps. This one will film front. Okay, we'll film front. This one, one, if I want to film anywhere. Uh, we have the bus. Right. Are you the one repairing the track? Yeah, it's a mechanic. Okay, what is the problem with the track? Yeah, the wheel? Boys. It's boys. Well, it's bearing. I don't know what is boys. Bearing, bearing. Bearing, ah, okay. Okay, wow, it's not a small problem. You have the spare part to repair here? Yes, yes. Yeah, I buy it. Yeah, okay, it how much you go pay to repair this one? How much you will pay, you know? Um, <laughs> Did you speak about price yet? 5,000 or 4,000. 4,000. 4,000. That's not okay. That's okay. That's okay. You know, if you want to repair this in my country, you go pay 40,000. I don't know much about dollar. Me, my money is euro. Uh, I think now euro is uh, one euro is uh, like 600 nera. Yeah. Before, when I arrived 10 years ago, one euro was 200 nera. So means the value of nera decreased by three times. Yes. It's very difficult for population, oh, you know, difficult. because the price of tomato and everything. Right, right, right. everything. Yeah, I get Nigerian number. Number. Yeah, number, number. Yeah, you can save them. No so, are you going to Benin side now? Or where, no, what side are you going? I'm going to Kaduna. Okay, okay, so you'll make U-turn and then go in the other direction. But normally, I normally go to Kano. How long from, from Lagos to Kano? How yeah. long is the journey with your truck? From Lagos to Kano. From Lagos to Kano. Where is where we shall be down? We're going to come in over like, let me see, Grand Corp. We're going to Grand Corp. Yeah? Full trip? Round yeah, trip? That's eight days. Eight days? Yeah, eight days. Four days to go, huh? Yeah, four days to go, four days to go. That's not small. It's so good. Remember the day. Uh, Afternoon, okay. Ah, uh, this is your second? Yeah. You are two in the truck? Yeah. Afternoon, yeah. 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 Huh? Are you going to Lumen today? Yeah, I think I would sleep in uh, Benin today. You know Wida? Yeah, I know Wida. Wida, I will sleep in. I think I will sleep in Wida tonight. So you're going straight to Kano now. Yeah, I hope they can fix the the truck fast. <laughs> Take care, boss. Take care. Oh no, voila, I will pick up yeah. It says on the phone that I have, I have like uh, 95 kilometers remaining before Kotonou. Going on a little slow path. I want to take my time. My mission is to reach Wida tonight. And I still have a lot of time. Our next stop will be in Sine Border. Let's go.
went down the King Floor. Yeah. You don't really care about one we go with the bank. Or oh, if they care, it's just to maybe greet me and spend some good time talking with a gang. taking the middle with a bumpy road like you can see now or going on the right side in the sand I took the bump <laughs> my tires are not really made for sand and yeah it's not so bad actually I'm 
very slow I'm taking my time I don't want to rush I just took seven days off I had seven days off so I decided I would take them with you guys uh, I think I would have to say hello to my friends policeman in front can you see them Good afternoon sir Afternoon Oga yeah. I'm surprised Because mostly they will stop me Not really to check my papers I'm very more to have a talk Many of these officers just want to know What is Oibo doing here alone with his small bike I got all my papers, so I'm ready for a talk. We are back again on the nice road. Uh, we are very close to Badagri now. Hope you are enjoying that trip as much as I do enjoy it. The weather is perfect actually. I found some friends for the way so I'll put my bag you can say hello to the camera you are going to see me border okay so we are going to the same here huh? Baji, you will have to tell me why is that because I don't know why is it okay let's go <laughs>
there are three on the bike. I just found two boys. They were going out from the school. And I guess it could be a good idea to give them a small ride. Welcome with little you guys. Here is another checkpoint in front. Now, so you may be wondering what are they doing with the sticks? I don't want to know. Good afternoon, sir. border with my two passenger I'm not doing Okada work we have to end with from here and there will be a lot of checkpoints because uh, this is the border now I mean the border region Try to smuggle fast. <laughs> I don't have a way. Okay. That's it, sir. Another guy with a stick. Yes, sir. That's a place where they are almost checking everybody, I guess. The thing which is a bit disturbing is. Uh, I mean, you can, you, you've seen there are a lot of policemen, uh, there are some guys from customs, but there are also some other guys and you don't really know who they are, they have a civil dress, most of them, uh, they look like very bad boys, <laughs> in fact.
going to see me in your sense. Okay, so I go from. Okay, you are going back from school now. You're going home now. Okay, take care. Have a good day. You see me far from here? Not too far. Second passenger is dropping at the border at Seme. Um, so I will drop him and I think I will make a small break before to cross the border too. I think we'll be in Seme border in less than 10 minutes. We've been driving together around 30 minutes now. We should be very close to Seme. border now you can see all the trucks waiting to pass the border I think I will soon drop my passenger uh, I, yeah, are you stopping here oh, okay where exactly here is fine okay hope the trip was okay you are very going very far to your school 
Your school is very far. Okay, take care, have a good day. Hello bros, how are you doing? I'm very thirsty. I guess it is a good time to take a small drink. I saw that lady. So I will ask her. This one is Pepsi? Yes. You don't have a Coke? No, no, no Coke. Coke, Coke okay, yeah, thank you. Thank you very much. How much did you sell? How much did you sell? 200. 200, okay, thank you. I will make a small break here in your place. Sit down and Yeah, thank you, if you don't mind. Oh, the weather is very hot for me. All the trucks here, they are wait to pass the border. Yeah, they are, they are pass. They wait. The border is uh, like one kilometer, two kilometer. Very close. I don't know two kilometers. How many? How many minute drive? Like for driving, if you drive, if you drive back, you did like two minutes, five minutes. Before I reach border. Yeah. Okay, okay, sorry, I'm at the border, it's very close now. I'm very surprised because now the road from Lagos till Seme is okay. Only small parts are broken, but that's a good surprise. They almost fix all the road now. <laughs> okay, thank you. Okay, what? Thank you. Thank you, madam. Okay, have a good day. So I guess it was the last stop before the border. I feel better after drinking and uh, let's see how it goes. So we meet again at the border.
I thought you were telling me the password. password. I thought you were joking with Why me. Why would I need your password? I have this camera doing in the trip. Huh? Okay, this one is uh, just uh, documenting my trip. Why oh, yeah. is the password? My English is very poor. I thought you were telling me, give me the password. Let me see this. There's a small, uh, very small camera. How much did you get this? This one, uh, if you buy it for Lagos, you will take it for 140. 140. 100,000. Yes, it's expensive. Okay. Yeah. Well, what's the, let me see. Huh? What's the resolution? Let me see the password. I'm still seeing Yeah, yeah, I'm, I'm seeking it. It's, uh, it depends on what you want. So it can be 1080p, can be a little bit bigger, but if you do bigger size. Okay, but the camera is good. Yeah, it's not bad. Yes, yes, yes. You see, it's stabilized. When you turn okay, on, so it's voice. Uh, it has a voice recognition. There is a there is a microphone. I was talking now, it came to you. Oh no! This is just because you film in front. You see, this one is uh, moving. He's following your moves. So he's following you, not me. He's following the moves. Let me show you, guy. <laughs> if you like, uh, if you turn like this, the yeah. cam will turn, but it's like make it okay, smooth. Slow. Yeah, yes, yeah, yes. Yeah, yeah. It's like stabilizer. Yeah, I understand. I'm digging for this passport. <laughs> it's a good, it's a good, it's a good uh, camera. Ah, uh, I wish you I could have your passport close to you. Why moving with your passport? I mean, because I know I will just take it out here. I don't want to move it out. Oh, I know they might have stopped you on the road. Yeah, yeah. Some guys sometimes are yeah. asking you, right? But because I don't want to lose it, so I put it deep. That is it, sir. I don't want to hear fast words, I'm very easy. Since August, since nineteen. Okay. I've been here even since twenty thirteen. <laughs> but with other passports first. When you dropped at the airport, okay, they cancelled that one. Mm -hmm. Twenty twenty-one. You still have other pages, okay? Oh, I have different one. All right, are you going, sir? I do, I do everything at the desk here. Yeah. Is it? Okay. Thank you, sir. Looks like I'm going here. Yeah. <laughs> huh? I carry you there? Yeah. Okay.
Thank you, sir. Thank you. Welcome. Now money change up. Okay, I get what I need. Thank you, sir. You got it? Yeah, yeah, I get it already. Thank get you. Safer. Yeah, I get it. Safer, Nera, I get both. Dollar? You get dollar? I don't get dollar. I'm a Nigerian boy. <laughs> <laughs> If you drive and go my village, Ghana. So. Ah, you're Ghanaian? Yes. Okay, what side of Ghana are you just I don't know. The only place I know is. Uh, one place I actually love a lot is Elmina. Elmina, yes. All this side, yes. all the fishermen, yes. village. Ashama, Nima. That's it. It's a very fine place. Yes. I like very peaceful. Ghanaian are very relaxed. Relaxed. No busy no. like in Naja. At all. <laughs> okay. Yes. I'm going. Okay, Mr. JK. Yes, sir. Is JK your name? Yes. Okay. Take care. Yeah. Have a good day. Yeah. Thank you, sir. I just did all the check at the border. I'm actually inside the border. And we are now entering Benin. I think this is the last check. I don't know whether I should pass or not. Let's go. What? Sorry, sir. Okay. Welcome to Benin. So, the border was actually very fine. I think I spent around 40 minutes there. They took a lot of time to check my passport and check all the entry and they had a problem because one of my entry was cancelled by a guy because he made a mistake in the date one day but now everything is fine and we can enjoy speaking french a little bit welcome to benin kilometer maybe uh, I will maybe make a small stop in Kotonou and then I will uh, drive directly to Wida I think during this uh, seven day trip I won't spend much time uh, in the cities actually because as you know I'm already spending all my time in a city of 30 million habitants so now I want to enjoy uh, the countryside line. Let's go to Benny.
in Berlin. Uh, for the second time in the history of Little Your Channel, you can still check some old videos. There are plenty of content you've maybe missed. Uh, once more time, please feel free to support me, share the videos. Uh, don't forget to smash the thumb up. And you can also drop as much content, uh, sorry, you can also drop as much comment as you want. Because each comment is helping a lot the channel to get more viewership, more audience. Uh, I was very surprised because the road from Lagos to Badagri was actually good I mean beside uh, like maybe 20 kilometer stretches that are still in sand almost all the expressway is finished and that's not a small news because uh, Lagosian, Nigerian and uh, people from Cotonou were waiting from that road since more than 10 years. So from here, from the border, we'll now uh, drive straight to Cotonou. And I think we'll make a very short stop in Cotonou, maybe just to relax five minutes and take a drink. And then after we'll drive to uh, Weda. Uh, as I told you, I'm uh, here on the seven day trip. I don't have that much time, but I will spare all these days uh, traveling with you guys. Uh, I hope you like this content. Uh, I hope you will enjoy. The theory uh, technically should be uh, a loop. So tonight I'm gonna sleep in Wida. I think tomorrow night I will drive a little bit around Wida and visit some places in Benin and then I will go till the Togolese border almost. I will stop in a place called Grand Popo on the seaside. This is the actual plan. Let's see. Uh, here is another stop. It looks like they are not here. Maybe that's the Hoga. We are now in Kotonu. Well, yeah. I will have to adjust uh, because I'm used to take the roundabout in the Nigerian way which is not a traditional way uh, so back in Benin I will have to adjust to the normal rules I would say uh, it should be very fine you can see many sellers here I think later I will stop to buy bread and some things. I don't know where I will sleep tonight. Uh, the only thing I know is that I don't want to spend much money on accommodation because I will not uh, hang around in my room. I will check for the cheapest accommodation I can find in Wida. And we'll see what it looks like.
Cotonou. I really hope you enjoyed that journey. We are not yet arrived. We'll maybe just see one or two things in Cotonou before to keep driving to Weda, which is our goal for today. I can see a red light and a biker is not stopping. Nobody stops. So I'm just adjusting to the traffic. I mean, everybody was burning that red light and there was someone following me. And at some point, it is more dangerous to do the things in a different way. So I'm following everybody's habit. So please don't flog me in the comment section. We are now approaching the city center of Cotonou. We'll cross the water. Can you see that view? Welcome to Cotonou. Oh, I can see some good waves to surf there. Can you see how this car is full? So, ah, Place de l'Etoile. Okay. They call this a square, the Star Square. La Place de l'Etoile is same, uh, same name as a very famous square in Paris. La Place de l'Etoile. So, I think I should be going straight, but I'm not sure. Bonsoir. Bonsoir. Pour aller vers Ouida, c'est celle-ci C'est tout droit Ok, merci. <laughs> So I found uh, my uh, SIM card in the MTN here. My previous one was locked, so I've changed it. Uh, the SIM card cost me 1,500 CFA, which is around three euro. And then I've charged 2,000 CFA. And I'll see if I can do all my trip with that. We are now at the stadium, and I have around 40 kilometers more before to reach Wida. Let's see how it goes. I will maybe try to do some change on the way too. 
you can see it's a pretty big square and I know that when you're coming here by night there is a lot of activity unfortunately I'm on my way and um, maybe that's the place I'm looking for to change money now let's see you behave uh, so I've tried to change money here but apparently it's too late uh, what time is it oh yes it's almost six o'clock so I will drive now directly to Wida I will not make any stop because I want to reach here before the night and find a place to stay I guess we'll see you again in Wida
we arrived in Wida. So from here, I will try to to go to the seaside, and hopefully, I will find a place to stay close to the sea. Welcome to Wida! This is what's happening when you are shooting and driving at the same time. So I'll try to be more serious for the rest of the trip. I almost got a chicken. So I'm looking for the seaside. Actually rebuilding the road I think the road I'm looking is the slave road and apparently they are doing some work on that slave road let's see oh yes I can see it's closed in front I hope I can follow the road till the end can see the work is ongoing okay let's go for a muddy adventure oh, yeah. So this road we are driving is the slave road. Uh, we are close to the place where I want to find a bed. Motocross. Can you see this beautiful sunset preparing? This place has changed a lot. Before there were some village here, two villages. I remember I went inside one of them. Yeah, you can see them. Okay. I want to bring you inside one of these village tomorrow morning. Last time I went there, it was pretty interesting. The people are collecting the sea, the salt from the sea. You can see in the background here. and now we are really approaching the point where i wanted to stop can you see that view that's pretty amazing wow they have destroyed everything around so i guess it's for the best This place has changed too much. Ah. 
Yeah, these hoops are very funny. Yeah. Diaspora Hotel. This is reception. I hope I'm not too late. Let's see. À demain, bonne soirée. C'est bon Merci. Ah, oh, c'est parfait. Parfait. Bon oui, oui, oui. 16 000. Il y a la clim là en plus. D'accord. Déposé. Merci, monsieur. Ok. Merci. Le passeport, il est là. Comment euh, je, je règle en partant demain, c'est ça ou je, ouais. Si je vais manger là-haut, je peux mettre la note sur la chambre. Si je vais manger au restaurant. Ah, vous allez payer le prix de retour là-bas. Ouais. Est-ce que. Vous, vous voulez régler le prix de la chambre. D'accord. Ok. Pas de problème. Merci à vous. Et. Euh, c'est avant, avant midi qu'il faut quitter la chambre, c'est ça Oui, c'est à midi. Midi, midi dernier délai. Euh, ouais. Ok, merci à vous. Merci. Vous m'accompagnez euh, Ah oui, d'accord. Ok, finally inside my room. As you can see, it's quite simple. But I have more than what I need. I have a TV, a bed with mosquito net, AC. Toilets and shower. In fact, I'm just gonna take a shower and I will leave again to try to see the. <sighs> I think I will start the AC to sleep tonight. Okay, camera is charged. Time to go. Bonsoir. Ok, I wanted to see the sunset. I am a little bit late. However, I'm gonna still have a look on the beach. So this is the second accommodation you can have here. These are quite nice. Actually, I've stayed here with my parents uh, when they came to visit me in Nigeria. We had a trip to Benin. It's really nice because as you can see, you are just in front of the sea. And uh, so these bungalows, these bungalows are around uh, 56,000 if my memory is good which is uh, something like four times the price of the room I'm paying for tonight uh, myself don't need that much uh, things because I think I will come to my bed only to sleep and five o'clock tomorrow morning I'll wake up and I think I'll bring you on a journey in different places. Ah, we are just a little bit late. I wish I arrived 30 minutes before, so we could have seen a nice sunset. 
I will check for food because there is one thing I remember here uh, when you order something at the restaurant it can take two or three hours before arriving look it's pretty empty Bonsoir. Bonsoir. Comment ça va Il est encore temps de commander à manger, c'est bon Ouais. Je peux commander, aller marcher un petit peu parce que ça prend un peu de temps. Et puis je reviendrai prendre après le. Bonsoir. Ça va très bien. Qu'est-ce que vous me conseillez Qu'est-ce que vous me conseillez qui sera rapide et facile pour vous et bon pour moi Du poisson. Ouais. Du ah, je vais plutôt. Euh, vous avez poulet Du poulet, vous oui, avez Du poulet, oui. Oui, juste riz, poulet. poulet. Et puis un peu de légumes sur le côté. Enfin. Une sauce légumes ou bien un peu de légumes Du euh, poulet avec du riz frit. Voilà, parfait. parfait. Poulet riz frit, c'est bon. Ouais. Et puis de la béninoise <rire> pour arroser un peu ça. Ah, la béninoise en bouteille. Oui, oui, oui. Les travaux, ça doit, vous de, ça doit vous causer du tort ici, là, non Ouais. Vous perdez beaucoup de clients, non Ouais. Là, c'est très calme. Oui, c'est calme. Ouais. D'accord. La bière, c'est important après une journée à conduire. <rire> Des petites, vous n'avez pas les grands modèles Non. Ah, je vais être obligé d'en voir beaucoup. Vous les vendez combien <rire> celle-ci Mais wow, C'est pe petite bière et gros prix alors. <rire> Allez-y, c'est bon. Merci. Merci beaucoup. <rire> ah, je suis dans le coin. Hein. Okay. Je vais peut-être marcher un peu, mais je reste là. Merci. So I think it's time to sleep now. The cans are charging.